<clears throat> okay. I have book one of three about today. Managing or managing artists in pop music. What every artist and manager must know to succeed. Now, it's the second edition, which is was in twenty twelve. I was actually recommended three books. This is the first one. And it does like part one is three days in life which is about a lot of chapters. Then contracts analysis or contracts analysis for managers and artists part two. Yeah. And it and uh so far, you know, pretty cool. Now, honestly, I think learning how to be your own manager is important. Also, this is the second vlog, too. Lucky. Let me get this down here. Okay. And, okay, so... Okay, dude. Okay, it features new s s sections on music sales and the digital age and all that, you know. Pretty, it's pretty, uh, I was looking through this. And, you know, it looks interesting, you know. I think chapter 18 is five year plans. Yeah. I forgot how much it cost me, actually. But all I know is all three books cost $104 for all three. Because I got, dig I didn't get digital, I got actual books. But you know what? I'm doing this for y'all either way. So I can read these and go, okay, do I recommend these or do I not? Yeah. No. That brings my, uh, ooh. My total books to three. Well, four actually, since I found my starting to run your own record label. That's How to Rap, How to Rap to this book, and it's how and starting to run your own record label. Honestly, this is a part of you know. Yeah, part of like, this, literally, as I said, you know, investing in yourself, which, you know, books, you know, also include that, you know, so I'm going to read this and I'm going to see if I recommend it. They have a lot of like sections. Now, let me read you the first um, mantra. A good manager's mantra. I don't know, but I'll find out. Huh. Anyway, y'all. Take a vlog. Bye-bye. Peace, y'all.